I don't. Sounds familiar, sounds very sinister. Nirvana. Something in the way. I can hear it now. It's a great song. I can hear it now. No, you can't. I'm not playing it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's hey, physics. <laughs> That's physics. Percy. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Great Measures. My name is Richard. This is Judson. Great Measures. J-U-D-S-O-N. Judson. <laughs> I know how to spell my name. You get a lot of Jetsons. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to start calling you Jetson. That's fine. A lot of people or do. Or Jet. I've got a cat named Jet. Yeah? Solid black. You think Joan would mind? Maybe not. She'd probably call the Runaways. I'm going to run away. Was well, she the Runaways? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. For a little <laughs> I while. didn't want to sound stupid. Uh, so, in a couple of recent videos that we did, you mentioned talking about how you like for songs and especially guitar solos and stuff to have feel to them. Yeah. It got me to thinking. It made me think of a couple of songs. This was one of them. Uh, have you ever heard of Alvin Lee? I don't think so. So he was in a band, I would, seventies, eighties, called Ten Years After. Okay. They had one hit that I know of. Probably a few more hits. They were a good band. He's an amazing guitar player. He was their lead singer and guitarist, and then. He had some solo stuff. And he had a solo album come out in 1994 called 1994. Very creative, very original. <laughs> very convenient. <laughs> yeah. That's uh, the year that Kurt Cobain died. Speaking of Nirvana. Oh, wow. I didn't even, okay. <laughs> That's cool. Synchronicity, um, Richard. Yeah, it is. Um, there's a song on there called The Bluest Blues. And in Pretty obvious it's a blues song. This guy's got some marbles, doesn't he? <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's a cool note to add to this. There's two solos, two guitar solos. The first guitar solo is a slide guitar solo. Okie dokie. Done by George Harrison. I know who that is. I know you do. And I figured that might excite you a little bit. I I don't get excited, you know? You're excited. So. <laughs> Maybe I'm a little. So, yeah, George Harrison plays the slide part on this song. A uh, lot of feel in this song. And, and to me, if there was a guitar tone that I could bottle up and drink or walk around and carry it with me for the rest of my life, it's this guitar tone. That's that's a pretty high. I just I, I don't know. It's it may not be the best thing anybody's ever heard, but it, this guitar tone is one of my it's it's my favorite guitar tone. Probably. Wow, that's high praise. It's I love it. It's good. Um, but it's not George's guitar tone. I mean, it's. They probably didn't let him put his guitar tone on the song. They may not they? have because. <laughs> Well, that was a joke about the Beatles not letting them put all the, his songs on their oh, records. Okay. But anyway. I got you. Yeah. You missed. I will say, Got My Mind Set On You mm -hmm. is one of my favorite songs. Really? I love that song. It's just a chipper, happy. Something by George Harrison is the greatest love song ever. Okay. You know this song. Speaking right? of high praise and hey, man, strong listen words. Listen to it. Okay. <laughs> that one is something else. Well, let's get to this one. Alvin Lee. Alvin Lee. Bluest Blues. The Bluest Blues. 1994's 1994. You got it. Okay, then. Did you know that the only song that Frank Sinatra ever covered by the beat Beatles? Mm -hmm. I don't know if I can say it. I don't know. Um... Or by George Harrison. It was by George Harrison. Something. He sang something. Okay. Only Beatles song he ever cool. did. Cool. Because you know I like Sinatra. I know how you do. Wait a minute. My head's shaped funny. Get it right, Judson. Proceed, Richard. Let's do it.
just at the scene with another guy. That's the bluest. Yeah, I was uh I was wondering why our clothes were on the floor. <laughs> Didn't come to meet me at the door. Your clothes were on the floor. Mm -hmm. Cause she was with another guy. Well, it is the blues. Yeah, it is the blues. Something I forgot to mention is he's British. Oh, he is. Mm -hmm. Shout out to the kingdom. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, blues. If your woman doesn't leave you and you're not drunk, which I am not. Correct. Um, then it ain't a blues song. Right. It's not all the way true, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Hit it! There's no one there to meet me And your clothes are on the floor I'm sorry if I hurt you And I made you cry I couldn't stand to see you With another guy It's the bluest blue Touch me like a knife. It's the bluest blue since you walked out of my life. Couldn't really tell how you hurt my pride. Something broke. Never knew I loved you till you went away. Now the loneliness surrounds me every day. It's the bluest blues since you walked out of the door. I will say. It's an interesting thing, like, so the song's going. All minor, one, four, five. It's the blues, right? Mm -hmm. But then, blue, that's blue. That F and G right there. It's just odd that sort of leaves the blues hmm. structure, you know what I mean? Okay. And the, the band that I was talking about 10 years after, they were technically classified as like blues rock. Yeah. You know? So there's probably some of that in there, I guess. Oh, man, this is sultry, you know? Yeah. Well, like... Sultry, broken heart, broken heart, sul sultry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, the lyrics are a little, a little common, you know. Sure. Cut me like a knife. Right. You know. Yeah. Hurt my pride. Things like that. But I mean, blues are pretty standard as it is. Yeah. I'm hoping the guitars do the speaking for you. For you, you mean? Well. I haven't heard them before. Maybe they'll speak to they'll you. They'll speak to me. Yeah, there we okay. go. There we go. Ready? Sure. It's the bluest blue Cause I won't see you no I was going to say is well I, I, one thing i've learned is not to pause during a solo <laughs> right, right 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 sorry 
I just, that's when I have an idea or a thought. But uh, I like it when slide players go down to the, mm. when they go down to low notes yeah. for me. I mean, you do all this stuff up here, but I mean, you drop down and mm -hmm. in, the, in the soul, of, you know. Yeah. I just love it when that yeah. happens. What do you think about that? Smooth, man. Yeah. Smooth. The tone? I mean, the tone's fat. Yeah. It's just this, like, like lazy boy chair with a blanket that you're sitting so in. Comfy. You know what I mean? Yeah, so it's comfy. a comfortable tone. Yeah. <clears throat> but it's also full and big and, like, every note just... And one thing that some people have trouble with on the slide is as you're, before you hit your note, that there's this mm -hmm. before they get there. Like, trucks will, Derek trucks will do that sometimes. You'll hear this mm -hmm. It adds to the sound sometimes, but sometimes that kind of gets to me. Sure. Luther Dickinson plays side, and you don't hear those in between. Mm -hmm. He'll drop down and hit those big notes, too. You know, the smooth players are the ones yeah. that I like. Um, but that tone lends itself to being able to yeah. cut some of that noise out, I think. Okay. What do I know? It's just George Harrison. What do I know? <laughs> He's probably got some George Harrison magic he put on. Yeah, it, you know? he sprinkled some George Harrison dust on it. <laughs> <Right>. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Ready? I am if you are. I'd like to say, he's considering whether it's his fault, he's to blame. Her clothes were on the floor, bro. Right. He found her with another man. You know what I mean? I know he's saying maybe he pushed her away or something. And maybe that's some lyrics coming up. I don't know. But it ain't your fault, Alan. <laughs> Alvin. Alvin. <laughs> Alvin. It's not your fault, bro. Hit it. Somehow I'm too I just can't live without you There's another day It's the bluest blues I'm feeling And it's here to stay It's the bluest blues And it cuts me to the bone It's the bluest blues
So, you bottle it up and take it with you everywhere. <laughs> I love that song. There's, so you know the end of that song with the chords that they were playing, which was... While my guitar gently weeps. I can hear that. Same chord. I can hear that. And it's interesting that George Harrison is playing on that sure. song. Yeah. Because they go from the regular just BB King Thrill is Gone chords like. I mean, and his guitar was weeping. Yeah, yeah. The tone, what I hear on that is, is first of all, I have to say the lyrics were pretty generic. Absolutely. The blue is blue. Come on, bro. Sure. Come on. Sure. Um, Cuts me like a knife, you know. I know some blues songs go that way, but. I'm with you. You know. Let's get past the lyrics. Well, that's where we're going. <laughs> <laughs> but the guitar tone sounds like he's got a compressor on it because sometimes when you, with a compressor on, when you hit the string, it's like an explosion happens. Mm -hmm. It's like, and you can hold notes mm -hmm. for as long as you're alive. Yeah. That's what it sounds like to me. And then, and then he's doing that thing with your pick when you kind of mm -hmm. move on the string and it, and it sounds like it's an octave, like right. ZZ Top does that a lot. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah, that was a cool, he, 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 he brought it to the, he brought it he on got a, He got a fist pump out of it. Yeah, yeah, man, well, I was just, you know, <laughs> holding it there. But, I mean, maybe he doesn't have a compressor on it. I don't know. Whenever I hear, sometimes when I hear uh, the guitar player in the that band that has the mm -hmm. red mm -hmm. and the white together and the Meriwether Boxer name put together, mm -hmm. that guy, mm -hmm. um, it sounds like he's got a compressor on his. I know... The other notable guitar player that I know is Trey Anastasio from Fish. He has a compressor. And whenever, especially back in the old days, when he'd hit a note, I'm telling you, it would sound like, and then you just, yeah. I don't know. It's just a, it's a fatter sound sure. on your notes. And it's like, yeah. it just sounds like an explosion in mm -hmm. every note to me. And then when you go, when you decide to get dirty on it, it's just way dirtier, yeah. way more. Yeah, I'd have a problem with that dude's guitar solo. I kind of wish he'd have gone a little higher and maybe just, mm -hmm. just, just freaking weld. Right. Yeah. And just, ah! but you know, Prince already did that to all my yeah. guitar jelly weeks. But that was that chord progression. I mean, straight up. Yeah. It's interesting. George was part of that song. That's cool. But uh, yeah, I'm with you on the guitar tone. It's definitely one that you could. Just sit down and ride around on, mm -hmm. bathe in, go to sleep in. Yeah, for sure. It can play any kind of music. It's a good one. You can play slow stuff with it. Yeah. You can play fast stuff with it. I was, you know, when you started talking about feel, that was that was one of the ones that. Do you know, know if he plays a hollow body guitar or if he plays a semi hollow body, like if it's a solid state guitar or not solid state, but like a, you know, like a Fender or whatever, or if it's like a Gibson, it's up, it's open. Because usually those I hollow bodies. Believe, I, Will hold the note for as long I as you want are alive. I want to say I've seen him with a Les Paul, but yeah, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I'm probably wrong on that. That's just where my my head goes when I picture him. Oh, you're just this is conjecture. Yeah, I don't know that for sure. Well, that's all right. Well, cool, man. I'm cool, glad man. You. Good. The bluest blue. It's, yeah, bluest blues. But, <laughs> the plural blues. So, <laughs> the Bluest Blues is a blues song. It is. From an album released in 1994. 1994. <laughs> With generic lyrics. He was just like, you know what, I don't care. Yeah. Just, He's like, I'm going to call a song. It's I've got, blues, man. I've got blues George blues. Harrison on this, and I'm going to uh, shred it up with my own solo. <laughs> right. So right. It doesn't yeah. matter. Just write your name down, George. Yeah. The rest of it, <laughs> it's blues. Blues, blues. What do you want to call the album? What year is it? Yeah. <laughs>
All right, cool. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. We are Great Measures. My name is Richard. This is... Great Measures? Judson. <laughs> we hope everybody has a wonderful day.